Hey, good morning. It's a new week. I bet you guys knew I was going to say that. <laughs> My kids give me a hard time all the time that I say that too much, but it's a new week and uh, we're out and at it this morning and today we are gathering cows that we brought out of Johns Canyon last week that we left for those few days. Uh, so we're down here kind of going on day two of that drive and we're going to get them out as far as we can again today and uh, then Wednesday we're going to be putting them on a truck and trucking them um, up to a higher spot on the winter range so a little better feed some green grass coming but we've got a busy week we've got lots going on again and uh, going to be moving a lot of cows this week to different pastures and then Saturday we're going to do a big brand um, so it ought to be a fun week and uh, we'll we'll see but I hope you enjoy the video all right starting to get these cows up boy they're really spread out down here they did great actually better than we thought we thought they might go up here and lay on the gate but they didn't they spread out and did really good this cow right here in front of me she calved since we brought him out the gate it's a little bitty new calf so we'll have to take him slow and easy today can't be more than maybe two or three days old uh but i got Jaden and wayne here today and uh it's a little bit chilly and windy and but good day also i get to ride crow today so i don't get to ride him very often uh the kids always been on him and they kind of claim him so <laughs> so while they're working i'm gonna ride crow so anyway he's turning out to be a pretty darn nice horse Jaden's riding Glade today. Cows, hey! 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 All right, starting to string these cows now and picking up a few more as we go. We got quite a few little tiny calves, and they were born in the last two or three days, and we're having a struggle with them. got all the cows together and now we're holding them up uh, gonna have a mother up for oh maybe an hour or so right here just need to make sure everything's paired up good Got the cows where we're gonna keep them overnight. We'll pick them up in the morning and take them the rest of the way to the krill.
Hey, sorry for the wind. It's a new day, kind of breezy. But we're down here getting started, getting these cows the last little leg to the corral this morning. Got about, oh, maybe four miles to go. And and uh, we're, we're trying to figure out how to load a cow to calf down here that we're gonna need to haul, just not gonna make it. So that's the way our day's starting today. What we got, Jaden? A little bitty calf. Looks like he was born last night. Yeah, just barely born. Gonna have to find his mom and put him in the trailer this morning. That's that calf's mother right there. She's got another calf kind of hanging around her, but anyway, we're gonna let things settle down here for a minute and see if we can get them in the trailer. All right, getting these cows all together again. They don't want to drive very bad. Uh, they're not mothering up very good, so we're kind of having a struggle here, but we're starting to get them a little bit. Okay, we are back with this cow, and her calf's laying right there, right there, and we're going to try to get them both in the trailer here. So, I don't know how much of this we'll be able to video. <laughs> it's going to take both me and Jade to get her in there, so anyway, we'll video as much as we can. And there's also another little calf standing on the other side of this cow that must have been laying here. And as we move the cows, uh, its mother is down the country where we're holding the cows. So we're gonna have to catch him too and put him in the trailer as well. Okay, Jaden caught this one. Lost his hat in the process, but he caught him. Now we'll go right here and put him in the trailer. All right, so we've been, got that calf caught and Sean just got this cow caught, so we're gonna let her wear herself out for a second and then we'll uh, go load her in the trailer. Hey, hey mama, let's go. So we got her in the trailer, had to stop video for a second, but she is in, thanks to Sean, through an <laughs> amazing loop. Hey, sometimes it's, uh, sometimes it's better to be lucky than it is to be good. Yeah, that's exactly how my shot was too, nothing but pure luck, but <laughs> we got him in and we'll get going now. Okay, good morning. It's shipping day. <laughs> we got trucks here and getting cows sorted and we're getting ready to ship them up to the upper winter range.
Okay, we got those cows in the corral and they're mothering up right now. And uh, sorry for the wind, <laughs> a little breezy right here. But Jaden and I have come back down to this winter range, uh, that lower part where we've been getting the cows out of for the last couple of days. And we're missing two cows. Um, and it just, one of those situations where we just didn't, didn't get them picked up or maybe they went off to calf or something like that uh, during the night. And so uh, this afternoon I'm riding back down in here. Jaden's in the pickup, he's ahead of me. Uh, looking around, see what he can find. But that's what we're gonna do right here. We're gonna see if we can get lucky and find these cows. Okay, quick update. We found one of the cows that we're missing. And uh, can see her way out here. Just riding out to get her. Um, don't see a calf with her. So we're looking all over, see. If she might have a calf too somewhere. But anyway, we found one of them. So that's good. Okay, got her lined out. We're about 99.9% .9 sure we have her calf in the trail up top that we hauled this morning. Um, just didn't pair her up yesterday and I her calf's up there in the trail and she's down here looking for it. So Jaden went back to get the truck and I'm gonna keep bringing her out. She's still looking for a calf a little bit, but for the most part, she's lined out and headed out of here. But we're a long ways from the corral that we were in last night, probably six miles. And so when we get her out here, where we've got the horse trailer, we're gonna catch her and load her, and then we're gonna take her up top to that, where all the other cows are still in the corral up there. Um, we're letting them mother up and anyway, we're gonna take her up there and get her mothered up with her calf that we think is up there. I wanna show you some cool petroglyphs that are right off the side of the road here. Just pretty interesting the way they look. I'll zoom in on them. Interesting petroglyphs, and then look what's on this side over here. Those are sheep tracks. Anyway, kind of interesting too. Okay, so Jaden's got the trailer set up over here. We'll get her out here and see if we can catch her. Took quite a while to get her out of that canyon. We've come about, I don't know how far, several miles, but we've got her out now. We're still at least three or four miles from that corral. And anyway, she's been doing pretty good, but we're gonna catch her and get her in the trailer right here. Okay, let's see if we can get her in the trailer here. Maybe she'll just jump right in. Wouldn't that be great? Oh my goodness, she did. <laughs> uh, she sure did. She just got right here. <laughs> she wants to ride home. Okay, well, no excitement here on the roping end of things. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> she gave Jaden a hard time and he was ready to choke her out. So, darn it, we ruined his fun. <laughs> ah. Okay, we'll get up to the trail. We hold that cow and we're driving out of here to take her up there. And I look over and here's the other cow we're missing. <laughs> so we really are, it's our lucky day for sure. So we're gonna jump out and go get her. Okay, so Jaden's rigging this up to tie this calf in. Okay. 
Now I'll have Jaden bring her right around the trailer and uh, we'll give her a shot to get in here without doing anything. Jaden, I'd bring her this other way. Here she comes. You stand right there and I'll, I'll bring her. There we go. Here she comes, here she comes. Oh buddy, worked twice today. Got her. Wow, that was slick. Okay. Well, there's the two cows that we're missing are both in the trailer, and now we can breathe a big sigh of relief. How about that? That's awesome. Two in one day. Never happened. Sweet. So, okay, we're headed out. Hey, what do you got? Heck yeah. Headed out, huh? Well, good morning. It's a new day and we're back at it again today. Today is uh, kind of a big day. We're moving all these cows into this pasture where we're gonna brand tomorrow and we, we're just scattered out. Got a big crew here helping us, which we're so thankful for, but you can see I got hired. He's gonna be riding his horse and Stephanie's helping me. And the Nilsons are all here today. Drew and Jeff and Robert and Trayson and Jaden and Kent and Quinn, and Cody, and Dwayne. So, <laughs> I'd say we got a big crew, but we're gonna need them because we are scattered out and we gotta take these cows 10 miles. And so, it's gonna be a big day. Should be fun, we'll see. All right, we're starting to find cows and gather them together. And we've split into three groups today. We're all going to meet up here in a couple of hours with our different groups of cows. So <laughs> that's the plan anyway. Uh, that's uh, the way we drew it up in the dirt this morning. Jeff and Stephanie and Hyde with us. Yeah, we were pretty, we were pretty disturbed about the prize and we just like, oh, good luck. All right, we got our little bunch on the road and going the right direction. And, um, we should meet up with that other group here in a couple of miles. We'll meet up with them. Hyde, he's doing okay today. Hey, aren't you, Hyde? Doing good? Yeah. All right. He's riding Rocket. Rocket is Kent's horse. And Stephanie's riding Jake. So we're just plugging along here. I'm riding Glade today. Boy, he's such a good horse. We love this horse. Just doing really good. Glade comes from Sandy Crusoe. Man, has he been a good one. Anyway, uh, I'll zoom in right there. Trayson and Kent and Drew, they're They've got their group of cows coming in and they're coming into ours right now. So we're getting both groups together. And then we'll have one more group after this. Quinn, Cody, and Jaden will have a group that they'll be bringing in a little farther down the road. But these guys are coming. Get them all together and head them up the road. Okay, lunchtime. 
We might be halfway there, but we're gonna stop and get some lunch. What'd you find? A baby pinecone. Found a baby pinecone? Oh, that's pretty cool. All right. Anyway, we're gonna get some lunch out here. I'm gonna let my horse's back cool out for a minute. He kinda hot. Let these cows pair up too, so. Did we? <laughs> Robert's been working hard today. Yes, I am working hard. Outworking everybody. We're about there, but man, it's been a push. These calves are terrible. Tired. All right, I wanted to show you kind of where we camp in the spring quite a bit, where we stay. Um, sorry, might be a little windy in this mic. Feels like it is. But anyway, this is a place we call the Rock Corral, and it is down on the Bar Diamond Ranch. And it's really centrally located to all the cows that we have to work. So we pull, well, let me turn the camera around. Okay, so we pull our camp trailers down here. It's a nice place for camp trailers. And then we keep horses right up here in what we call the Rock Corral. This is just a really neat little corral that was built by the old timers and uh, we've fixed it up a few times and kind of got it where it's pretty nice. We keep water and hay here so that we can keep horses here when we need to. Um, but it's, it's a really neat little kind of a rock cove and we fenced off the front of it so the horses and stuff can stay up in the back and anyway it's just kind of cool so i'll show you what it's like like i said it's got a water trough in there that we keep water in and we bring hay down and leave some hay right there and it's just really Kind of a neat little place to keep horses. So we're gonna get our horses out and stick them in here. Snakes. This is terrible. <laughs> it's a little rattlesnake. Should I pick him up? Yeah. No, Got heck him. no. For the, for the no. views, dude. <laughs> Do it. No. Do it. <laughs> I'm literally sleeping on top of the horse Those trailer. Will mess you up. Yeah. They won't. They don't control their amount of poison no. they put in you. All 
all right branding day <laughs> we got a good crew big crew here today and we're gonna go gather a whole bunch of cows and we'll have them in the trail here shortly hi's ready to go again today getting everybody mounted up this morning we had some vehicle problems on the way here so it took us a little longer to get out here so now we're all rushing to get where we need to get Most of these horses you guys already know that we're riding. This horse here though that I'm riding, his name is Rage and he is my wife's horse. Uh, I don't think you guys have ever seen him on here before but uh, he is out of a stud called Red's Diamond Jack off the Pizza Ranch. Uh, that stud died I think last year or two years ago but they don't come much better than this horse right here. I think she'd be a little upset if she knew I was riding him right now too. So <laughs> there's only a select few that get to ride him. So it's pretty nice. Robert's been working hard out here for the last couple of days. So. Yeah. Oh, not too hard, but you know. <laughs> He's got his chair, him and Hyde got a maid over here. Yeah. <laughs> I have to share my experience. The younger cowboy. And Jeff. Yeah. Jeff's running sport ball. Yeah. Until the real man's job. <laughs> yeah. well, we're happy to have these guys here with us again, so it's pretty good.
been burning cattle all day. Little Ray Lynn is just out. What do you think, Hyde? That's a good horse, huh? Yeah, he What's his name? Cow Chaser. Yeah, it's old Cow Chaser, huh? Okay. All right, that's a wrap. We're done. Branded about 150 today and had a great crew and good people and uh, we're all dirty. We got dirt in our teeth and our eyes and other places we won't talk about, but good day. Uh, had a great crew, good people. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the, the video and we'll see you next week.